What's going on everybody? Welcome back to Bytown Bassin. I'm out at a new location, never fished it before. Word on the street is there's largemouth bass. I want to experience it for myself, so we're here today. We are on, there we go. We're hitting the water right now, let's go. All right, we're locked and loaded, ready to go. I'm gonna start out with the watermelon Senko. Very, very basic, but I just wanna get a baseline of what's going on here. I have no idea if there's fish here or what kind of fish are here, so always safe to start with this guy. Let's get it in, see if we get any hits. Freaking nice clear water, that's for sure. See some boulders out in the water there. I just casted right on top of them. Should be some fish kicking around there. Oh, there's a hit, guys. I think we're on. We are on. There we go. First fish of the day. Let's go. What is it? Oh, it looks like a good bass. Oh, that's a real good bass. What is it? It's a largemouth. Holy crap. Friggin' nice largey, guys. Oh. <laughs> there he is. He's in the net. Oh, let me get him on hook. We'll give you a better look. Well, just like that, we're on the board with a big old bucket now. Got it on the Senko. I think I'm going to switch it up down to a few little different presentations, see if we can get them on a few different types. Let's freaking get them back. Imagine there's not a ton of structure in here. I should have brought the deeper to take a look, but just like every other quarry, tends to be a lot of vegetation on the edges along the walls. That's where the fish are gonna congregate. They're able to push the bait fish up against the walls and corral them. They get some cover, some hiding. They're able to hide under the rocks. It's uh, places like this, the, those are the spots you wanna target. Just work the walls, work the edges. This looks nice. A lot of big boulders, some vegetation. Burn it over these weeds here, see if anything destroys it. If not, we'll adjust accordingly. I don't know what they want. All right, I'm gonna put the Senko back on, try it in this area here, see if we can get any more hits. I'm gonna try a different color though. I'm gonna try a black. I feel like there might be a lot of leeches in here. So we get the black color going, it's gonna look really natural. And fish catch it. Got that watermelon green pumpkin. Very, very natural. Saw a rise over in the really shallow water there. Let's see if we get hit. Oh, there's a bass over there. Oh, he's right behind my... Oh, here we go. Oh, oh no. Well, they really seem to want the Senko. I mean, I'm going to keep working it for now. It's kind of boring, but had a kind of slow start to bass opener this weekend. So I'm just down to catch some fish right now. All right, guys, I see a bass. Good, good little largemouth right in front of me here. I'm going to swing right on him here, see if we can get him. Boom, right in front of him. See if he goes for it. There he is, there he is, come on. Oh, there he is, come on back, bud. Here he is, here he comes. It's a good sized fish. Oh, he's turning on it. Oh, of course the beaver comes over. What are you doing, bud? Look, the bass is chasing the beaver. Ah, man, I wish you guys could see the things I see right now. Let's see if we can get a little closer without spooking him. There he is. Uh, he must be in spawn mode. Here he comes, here he comes. Oh, glided right by it. Hmm, Let's see if I can get it in front of him maybe. There he goes, come on. There he goes, he got it. There he is. 
That was friggin' awesome. Wow, that was so cool. My gosh. Well, it took a couple casts to get this big girl, but we friggin' got her. Sight fish this guy right in the shallows. Got it on the Senko. I think she was guarding some fry though, so we're gonna get her back super quick. Let's go. Oh, they're totally in fry guarding mode, man. Come on, gotta go. Okay, come on, now it's on. Now it's on, come on. How are you not gonna grab that? Man, oh, come on. Oh my God. Oh my God, I saw his mouth open. Okay, okay, I'm gonna try to do what I just, just did again. Drop it down on that rock. Oh my God, I saw his freaking mouth open. Oh, such a large bass. As I'm recording this, I can literally see the large mouth that's evaded me all night swimming by guarding its fry. I tried so many presentations to get this fish, guys. I'm just happy I was blessed with two nice large mouth tonight you guys really enjoyed the video, please hit that like button. It helps me out a ton. And if you feel the channel's worthy enough to subscribe, please do so. It means the world to me. I put so much into these videos. Really appreciate you guys watching. See you at the next spot.